was way too cold outside, so I have to come inside my teepee. The Arctic can get very cold at this time of year. The Arctic is the most northern part of the Earth. Some of the different animals you can see in the Arctic are Arctic foxes, Arctic wolves, lemmings, bald eagles, whales, walrus, seals, and many more. But in today's episode of Animal Talk, I'll be talking about the most mightiest animal in the Arctic, the Ursus murdimus. <laughs> Ursus murdimus is the scientific name for the king of the Arctic, the mighty polar bear. The polar bear is a huge mammal that can weigh up to 1,500 pounds and that can stand up to 10 feet long. That's like three times my height. Polar bears can be found in countries that surround the Arctic, like Alaska, Norway, Russia, Greenland, and Canada. Two thirds of the world's polar bears are found right here in Canada. Here's a fun fact about Canada and polar bears. Polar bears were the official mascot in the 1988 Winter Olympics game held in Alberta. Polar bears mate in the spring and hibernate for most of the winter. Mother polar bears give birth to their cubs in snow dens between November to December. Polar bear can have up to four cubs at one time, but usually just has two or three. A baby polar bear is born so tiny. When the baby polar is born, they weigh less than one pound. They're about the size of a kitten. Baby polar bears are born blind. They drink their mother's milk, which is high in fat, to help them grow big and strong. Cubs stay with their mother for two years after they're born. During that time, their mother teaches them the skills they need to survive on their own. Look at these polar bear cubs playing with their mama, rolling around in the snow. They're so cute. Here's some facts about polar bears. Alaskan natives hunt polar bears as a part of their culture. They eat the meat and use the fur for clothing and blankets. A male polar bear is called a boar and a female polar bear is called a sow. Polar bears have an excellent sense of smell. They can sniff a seal's breathing hole from over one kilometer away. Polar bears have a foreign layer of fat under their black skin. That's right, polar bears have black skin to soak up the sun's rays so then they don't get cold on the harsh winters. Turns out polar bears fur isn't even white. It's transparent, which means it's see-through. So it just takes on the color of its surroundings. Polar bears are the largest land carnivores and they'll eat up to 100 pounds of meat a day. And they love to eat seals, but if they're desperate, they will eat a walrus. Besides seal and walrus, polar bears will eat eggs, shellfish, reindeer, and berries, but only if there's a shortage of their favorite food. There are between 25 to 30,000 polar bears left in the world. The largest threat to polar bears is climate change. Increasing temperatures around the world are melting sea ice, which makes it harder for polar bears to find their food. Even though I wasn't able to find a polar bear, I did find an Arctic fox. Just kidding. This is my puppy, Kingy. I hope you guys all enjoyed this episode of Amica. This is Tarzan, signing off for today. I hope to see you guys all real soon.